Howdy y'all, this is Reckless Raven, and welcome back to our adventures here in Paleo Pines, where last time we were working on some of our things that we have around the ranch, and I didn't even get to the thing I wanted to do today, because we were looking around everywhere, we can't find Zara. Uh, we have a quest from Zara to go on ahead and, uh, Sorry, I'm going to turn off this alarm that went off. We have to give her all these materials, and I have them still in our pockets, which is nice. Um, it's a good thing we still have them. However, however, I can't find her. I cannot find Zara. Uh, it says she's at a different location. I couldn't find her on any of our uh, maps, so maybe we'll find her eventually, but I don't know. Anyway, um, we had that quest, but while I was trying to go and fulfill that quest so I could have that quest off of our roster thing, um, couldn't find her, I went and saw some dinosaurs in the desert, and there are several that I want to acquire because I like them too much. Anyway, so we're gonna go ahead and go do that. We have done everything for the day here in the house. Um, we cleared out a bunch out there, like we usually do, and uh, said hi to all of our dinosaurs, checked the crops. We really need to do that um, crop tending thing, and that's why we were going to do things around the farm and move some of our dinosaurs around. Surprise, surprise! Couldn't do that. Anyway, so let's go on ahead and take a run, actually. While we're here, uh, we need the poster switches. To complete our valley set of dinosaurs, so poster switches. I went the wrong direction, didn't I? Yep. Hi! You are cute. Ooh, what? There was an Asaurus around here today. It is anything. I got a run. I came the wrong direction. I knew I was. Something went wrong. And I did notice in the comments that someone asked how... That they were, they were impressed of how good I seem to be sometimes about identifying some of the dinosaurs. Several of the dinosaurs, I am a dinosaur nerd. I am a little bit of a dinosaur nerd. So like the Parasaurolophus, the crest, that's obvious. The Pachycephalosaurus, uh, that one is, you know, the dome head is obvious. I wouldn't have known the post of Suches without um, help. Because it, it looks like a theropod. It's definitely in that family. But I wouldn't have known exactly which dinosaur it was. And actually, I believe I saw somewhere that Posasuchus is actually more of a more related to like Sarcosuchus, I believe. You get to have some juicy things. We're gonna give you an apple. Um, which I thought was extremely interesting, and I wanted to really dive into it. Let me try again. Let's give you a bell pepper. So, yeah. I, I am a slight dinosaur nerd. I like going into the theories and learning more about them. The peppers are the only thing we have for spicy, and I want that velociraptor. So, the more information I learn about them and stick into my brain, the more I, I find it so interesting. It's, I don't know, it's weird. And then it sticks in my brain more than anything else in normal life. It's hard. Anyway, so there's, there's little dinosaur facts in my brain. Let's try a chili pepper. Cause like, the apples are going up and down. Same amount. 
Maybe no juicy. But yeah, most of them, it's I recognize the the species just because of some of the the stuff that it has in it. Um, I know exactly what I'm calling this one. Spinel. You are so cute, new print. So this is gonna be Spinel. Um, I have to look up just which, like all the information on Spinel to know the, but I do know that it is a gem stone. I know it is a gem, so we have that. So we have Spinel. Welcome, welcome, welcome. For a little group. Some of the other things that I recognize on the dinosaurs, I can recognize like the Eucephalus and Pinacosaurus are in the Ankylosaur family at first glance, but I do not, I don't recognize them specifically. I wouldn't have recognized them until someone told me the exact name for them, which now I technically have memorized. But once I get the name, I need to find, I still need to find the uh, naming on some of the things. Anyway, we're gonna run. So yeah. Some of them are obvious. The the Dimetrodons, those are, those are Dimetrodons. The Tyrannosaurus, once you actually see it and see how big it is, it's called Lizard King for a reason. Um, Parasaurolophus, Pachycephalosaurus, Triceratops was fairly obvious. The ones that aren't super obvious are like, um, what was it, the Centrosaurus? The Velociraptor and Utah Raptor actually threw me for a loop because technically, technically, Velociraptor was supposed to be larger than Utah Raptor, but we have Utah Raptors here that are taller than the Velociraptors, which is interesting. I can go into a whole history lesson of why they're called Utah Raptors and stuff like that. But anyway, so we want this blue one. Welcome to our little group. You're adorable. Okay. So we have Sapphire and Spinel. And technically I'm at the point I need to go home and send someone to a pen. But I took a look. The the plan I'm doing for hi. Sorry. I didn't realize that was in your space. Um the plan that I put through for Zara's back at home. Oh, thank you. Okay. For the dinosaurs that I'm planning for the names, like the some of the ones we have, um, I did have to look up some colors. So I know a little bit of the colors on Velociraptor and Utah Raptor. I'm sorry. Um, but I have a good, decent enough reason. I wanted to do something fun and special since we started naming them after gemstones. So, some of these guys are getting fun and interesting names. I think. Okay, so this Utah Raptor is technically the color scheme that I want. But you can see how they're both different patterns. Technically, the one I want is that pattern. 
but this color. Yeah, I'm so sorry. So, we're gonna wait. I think I remember it seeing it was uncommon, so it's not... We're gonna see him again. We've seen so many of the Velociraptors, so we should be fine. I just feel bad for it. We're doing that. Alright, hi. Why are you having finding materials for my printing press? I've got them all. This will do perfectly. I cannot wait to publish our discoveries and share them. Take these as a thank you. I love cooking with citrus fruits. Ooh, an orange and a lemon. Okay. Oh, and she gave us some shells. Okay. Thank goodness we have all that space back. Now I can go collect some saffron and um, some of the other things on the way back. This will be nice. Okay. Take a slow trip back. And actually go do some resource gathering from the outer areas. Like this. it was ginger or spice root. I think it was spice root that I needed. Also collect the ginger because we're low, but I think I needed spice root for that one thing. I'm looking for sparkly things. Like that. That's the prickly pears. Gosh darn it. I'm not gonna even attempt to have Lucky do that. No. Spice root, we wouldn't be able to use it. Do anything with it. Okay. Oh well. We need prickly pears too. Go ahead and check. That's spice root. Alright. Let's, um, go check on this Allosaurus down here. There's gonna be something in this space. There's gonna be something in this space. Just isn't here yet. Because that just, it screams someone's gonna be here. Which probably means it's just going to be a dinosaur spreading out and checking things out. And possibly during a different season. I've noticed that some of them don't branch out as much in certain seasons. Hi. Nature, time, and patience are the three great positions. Hello? Okay. Suspicious. I don't see anything in there. Have we broken that one yet? I think we've broken that one. Okay. Technically, I have chili peppers in my pockets. I know you can't gather these. Yeah, you're the tangerine color, I believe. go home. I think technically the Velociraptor can go. I think that pan is big enough with Ruby. I don't think they need too much space. It's the postus sushis that's going to be difficult. It's, if I remember correctly, postus sushis is a loner carnivore. 
thankfully most carnivores don't eat that much. And thankfully, both of our followers are runners. Alright. Yeah, yeah. I would love to do where we run and then look backwards and see our little friends following us from behind, but that's gonna be difficult. Alright. The crickets are going. It is nighttime. We need to go home. Um, oh, I was supposed to get a decor piece for, what's his name, is Corlin gonna still be in the shop? Might be, I might, it might catch him just in time. Okay, there's the bridge. Hard to see at night. Today is Sunday, so it's Dracosaurus Sunday. He is still available. Alright, do you have any kind of desert decor? Nope. I don't have any decor today. Darn it. <laughs> You'll be back. Yes, I will. Especially because I can kind of tell that um, Obsidian might become a helper soon. So we'll need another saddle. If we get the hem biome to change, that's the other thing. Oh yeah, I didn't check. Unless we get him a pin, we'll poke that. But for now, we're just gonna go with what we got. Storm, why are you always outside of the pin? Sapphire liked hot hair and music today. That trough is fine. Let me see Ruby. Okay, so they are happy. I do believe this is Ruby's pen. It's a pack now. Okay. So Ruby is a common color, sunset, and Sapphire is an uncommon color. Good. And then our no pen is Spinel. Orchid is a rare color. Alright. Let's do this. Let's go figure something out. Spice root. Gosh. It's like the Allosaurus is so big compared to the Postosuchus. I like seeing the size differences. It's really impressive to me. Alright, we're gonna have to move Onyx sooner than I thought. Um... Right. That in storage. I 
gets the oranges. Okay. Uh, hey, we got put back on this one. All of these. Hmm. There's already a thing in there. I need. I'm gonna have to steal. Is there already a, a stone in here? Yes. I'm gonna have to grab that stone. That's considered a pen now? Lucky in the way? Or is it because it's too close to the house? Might be too close to the house. This doesn't have a biome right now, does it? I don't think the pond has a biome. I think we have time. We have time. Let's go grab Onyx. We'll grab all the things out of Onyx's plan and figure some things out. So I know that they're going to hate it, but hear me out. What if... We put this back in. For tonight. Yes, I know you're unhappy, and this is not the correct anything for anything, but I should get lucky. Alright. What have I done with this? No progress. Good. Sorry, Onyx, I know. We'll fix that in a minute. Come on, Onyx. I got your pan over here. It's a little occupied for now with some of the crops. But it'll be fine. I got a thing that says Prima Donna make one enormous pin for one solitary dinosaur. Love it. A little bit, no, I guess it. Okay. He'll be happier. Now we need to go get a decoration piece for Spinel's this pen. Oh. Alright, 
mature heather bush, large valley flowers, small valley flowers. Let's do this one. Wood, fiber, dandelions, and clovers. So let's see. I don't have enough. Nope, I need the clover. Fiber, wood. I need more wood. We're gonna take tank out a lot late in the next couple of episodes. Oh, I do have enough. Ooh. Where's my book? Gosh dang it. Come here. Oh, and I still need a trough for... Still need a trough. That's why I didn't want to put him over there. Darn it. Alright. My book. Okay. Um, grab that. Because we need to do that next time. We got Spinel happy as a clam in their pen. They're doing great. Um, technically, I need to get a food truck for him, but it can wait just a hair. Come on, Bunty. They'd be out of food the next day. They're so cute. How's your trough doing? Some of my big eaters. there, but not quite. Okay. Okay, that should be everything, I think. For now. upset with us. Amazonite is now a helper. Who is Amazonite? Spinel. <laughs> Happy friend. Uh, Amazonite. 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 Was the Archaeopteryx. Okay. We've got all rare colors of that. That's amazing. We need to clean their pen. So we have a lot of things. One crop is ready, nine crops need watering. 
everyone needs attention. It's a Monday. We need to get ready for the thing that's coming up. I don't know what it is, though. Alright. Well. We need to put pathways down, too. Look at this. This is... This is... No. Not a sit. Alright. We need to get food for Onyx. Um, we need to get a lot of things going. Alright. Yay! Anyway, thank you all so much for joining me today. If y'all could, do please leave a like. Leave any tips, tricks, thoughts, or suggestions in the comment section down below. And do please consider subscribing. I will see y'all in the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye.